I think motor racing is something that is a very strange commodity. It's a, a balance. It's something that takes a man to the, the outer perimeters of life. Some people believe they've got to think of themselves as the best in order to succeed. I never ever thought that. I was always thinking I wasn't going to win. I was always thinking that everybody else is better than me. A racing car is, a, is an experience which is difficult to compare with anything else and therefore it's difficult to, to portray to people. But the existence itself is so enormous, it's so fantastic, it's so full of colour that I wouldn't know even how to start. Of course motor racing is dangerous and it never will become completely safe no matter what anyone does and of course people die. And even our children felt it but I remember Paul saying he asked me when I was when I was going to die because everybody else at school, two parents had lost their lives and it was logical in a child's mind to say that well your daddy must die soon too because of everybody's racing driver daddy dies. All of us, whether we be just normal humans or other kinds of humans, have a little pocket in here, a reserve, something that every time we lose a friend, a member of our family, this little pocket of fluid seeps out and allows the pain and the sorrow and the sadness to be diluted, to be removed in some way, or at least the pain to be endured. It seemed at Watkins Glen that my little pocket had run dry, that there was nothing left in Jackie Stewart to combat the feeling of remorse and sadness. 